During a recent buffalo translocation, the crew had to navigate deep sandy roads which required significant driving skills to keep their precious cargo safe. Struggling to find the road. So you find a path to walk. <laughs> to avoid getting stuck, the trucks followed smaller game paths on the open plains, taking great care not to lose any momentum as once they stopped, getting going again was no easy feat. With the help of crews from both Izamvelo KZN Wildlife and Maputo National Park, a tractor was used to pull the trucks out of the sandy trenches and back on more solid ground. As seen here, this was a time-consuming exercise that required patience and determination. We've just received 45 buffalo from Tembe Elephant Park and it's uh, part of our rewilding program with Maputo National Park. So very good and grateful that we can get these buffalo and it will just boost our numbers as we go along. Okay, Tembe Elephant Park, a surplus buffalo that they wanted to take off this year. And with them being in the red line in South Africa, it was easy for them to relocate their animals to us. We only got to the offloading ramp after dark, so we are now finally finished and it's almost 10 o'clock. Buffalo form part of the ecosystem and uh, they were removed from this area and they're really important for as bulk grazers to, for the vegetation and uh, they just form part of the whole ecosystem and that's part of our rewilding and historically they occurred in this area. I mean it's been a long day, I mean we've been up uh, since half past four in the morning uh, it's almost 10 o'clock now, but I mean, we, every time we, we successfully translocate animals, we get that fulfillment. So we are fulfilled. The conservation areas, we know that in the early years, uh, the animals had the, the rest of Africa to roam around. And the more space we can find for them and the, the cooperation between different reserves from international communities, it's the best for the animals. And I'm, I'm very happy and it's becoming a success. And uh, today just marks one of those uh, successes and we hope uh, in the future there will be more of them. When you see them running off into their new home and nothing's been injured on the way, then it's uh, rewarding and uh, we're doing the right thing. <laughs>